Anyway, just see if I can run through this and see if I can um, duplicate what you're talking about. First thing I usually do here, because I can't stand all these visual things, is I get rid of my visual aids. Uh, I don't need them in a template anyways. Um, so here's a word. I know what you're saying. It's like you're clicking somewhere, but it's clicking somewhere else. I'm wondering if you turn off your visual aids as well. Um, but I'm going to tell you something. Honestly, when I'm te editing text in, uh, in Dreamweaver, I don't actually, like I've got the page open that I, if I'm saying I'm updating a customer site or doing like a content transfer or something like that, I don't actually leave the visual design turned on because it's not really, to me it's not required. And I, what I, I kind of wish um, there was an easy button up here, you just flip off the, the CSS in the background and basically turn this into a word processor or, or, or text editor just while you're doing the content. Because usually what I do here is I just go to my view button when I'm, um, editing. Go to my style rendering and you see the display styles? Yeah, I get rid of it. Right, and then all you're doing right down here, right, once you get to the section of your page you want to actually edit, which is usually right about here, right, after all your components and that. Right, so now you're editing text and it's just like editing it in a, um, in a Word, Microsoft Word or something like that, right, where everything's really simplified. Right, so you got the services. You can go to HTML or CSS and just apply whatever different properties. Right, so if it's CSS, sort of HTML, you can change your headings and your formatting. But as far as editing text, it's to me, it's just a whole lot faster and a whole lot easier without all the distraction of the design in the background. And what I do typically is I will always have a page, for example, the services page. I'll have it previewed in a browser, and I'm a, I'm a multi-monitor kind of a guy. I've got two monitors going here, so I'll have this page over here in another window right and then i do 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 you know file uh, save after i made my changes to this i just go back to my th my page and i hit refresh i'm just sharing that with you because everybody has their different techniques um but i just found that when doing content transfers in dreamweaver it's easier just to get rid of the visual display when you're actually editing the content in the page and then you can just whip it back right display styles turn it back on when you're done if you really want to do that um to see right but I always find it's easier to uh, get things to line up and whatnot uh, when you actually have the page open in your browser so at least you're seeing what your visitors see but as far as the content sort of going off to the side and whatnot but what you're saying is like when you put your cursor here it's it's deleting somewhere else I'm not exactly finding that and I haven't actually heard anything like that um, let me see if I turn my visual aids back on if it does anything no I, you, you know what I'm wondering, and it might be an oddball, um, I wonder if it's a video card, like a rendering issue in the video card, if it's doing something weird with the, nah, that probably wouldn't be it. I've seen that happen rarely on other occasions, but no, I'm not, I know what you're talking about, sort of, but I'm not finding that, like you put your cursor here, but it edits something over here, right, you know, four, you know, a few letters away or something like that. Um, Anyways, I just thought I'd try and display it or whatever in uh, uh, the editor here to see, right? Selecting whatever I want without a problem, so I'm not sure.